Hi everyone, this video is going to be about the narcissist and money. I don't know what your guys' experiences have been about the narcissist in your life and how they treat money, but I'm sure if you guys leave the comments below, it's going to probably be very entertaining, some of the stories that we share. In my case, um, I have witnessed where a narcissist has been owed, let's say, maybe $10. They're owed a $10 credit from maybe somewhere they ordered something from online. And because they are owed this credit, they will drive themselves bonkers over a $10 bill. They will waste hours of their time, sometimes days. This can go on with them calling and, and arguing with people at the place. Um, they get so flustered. This can go on for weeks even over a $10 credit. Another situation I have actually seen is where a narcissist in my life literally came home, looked at the receipt, and because they were gypped a couple of dollars, something didn't ring up on sale at a grocery store, drove back over 30 minutes just to have them correct it and give them a few dollars back. I mean, it's not even worth the gas to do that, but this is how their mentality works. And it's not even worth losing um, your peace and arguing on the phone for days, weeks, over a $10 credit either. But narcissists, they love money. I mean, we all like money, okay? It makes life easier when we have it. But they love it and they will use people for it. They will think ahead. Um, let's say if there's a family member or a parent that's getting elderly, in the backs of their minds, they, and this is a true story too, but it, it's for another video, but in the backs of their minds, they are thinking what they will receive when that family member goes, passes on. So if they can use people to that extent that they're looking at an elderly parent or an aunt or an uncle or, or what have you, realize what they are using you for in the relationship. Is it your money? Are you supplying that to them? Is it something like um, they're using you for their ego? Are you like a trophy to them? Do you give them compliments all the time? Do they need to be coddled and babied um, and put on a pedestal? I mean, it's one thing if you have a respectful man or woman in your life and you put them on a pedestal, but not every man or woman deserves to be on a pedestal and certainly not an abusive, toxic narcissist. They do not deserve to be put on a pedestal, but a lot of them need their egos um, to be praised. They, their egos make them need to be praised constantly, and it, it just gets so draining how much attention they need and how much validation they need. And it doesn't matter how much you give them either. I mean, they will still say that you are ungrateful and you could be doing more, nothing will be enough. But back to the money thing, um, they will waste their youth working and being a workaholic. They won't go on vacation, some of them. They basically are just focused on money. And it's funny because also in my experience, the narcissists that I have seen that have this obsession with money all the time, um, somehow, Fate would have it, karma would have it, that they start losing money throughout the years. Something will go wrong financially for them, an investment will go bad, a car will break down. Like It, it, it just seems to be where a lot of uh, bad luck will happen to them, and there goes that money. So I do believe in karma, um, and I think that sometimes... They love money so much, and it seems to be that that is what they are usually attached to. And so somehow their karma makes it where that starts to be taken away from them. 
But anyways, so I just wanted to do this video about the narcissist and money, and I would love to hear what your guys' experiences have been uh, when dealing with the narcissist and observing their ways with money, especially like some of the funny things they do. Oh my gosh. Anyways, thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the video.